My name is Mackenzie. Uh, I'm a single dad. So being a single dad is a little bit, a little bit more hard than being with a with another partner because it, it turns into like a one man job when it's supposed to be two. Even if I did have like a boyfriend or something, it'd be, it'd be even easier because we could swap or he could get up in the middle of the night instead of me. It's way more difficult being single. You have to pay for everything by yourself. You always have to go grocery shopping and holding a job and having a newborn baby is definitely the hardest thing I've ever done. Very time consuming because you have to be, my son's name is Joel, you have to be around him all the time. It's very stressful. Well, yeah, being around him all the time is awesome. I fucking, I love it. But it can be at some points a little bit difficult. Just eh, a little stressful. Having good friends is a good way for a single parent to um, try to get a little bit of relief every now and then. Or living with your mom. That's good, so you can take a shower. It's always nice having someone, especially with a baby. So when mom's here, and she'll help or try to help out as much as she can. But living with my mom is, I don't like living with my parents. <laughs> my parents, it feels like you can't do anything that you want to do or, you know, just weird. It's just like, oh, I'm playing Smash, so leave me alone. But now it's a little bit easier, Joel's older. So I've lived by myself now compared to then. I wouldn't have been able to do it with a newborn baby, so I'm glad I was with Beth when Joel first came to the world. But now I think it'd be much easier because he's older. And you know, he can eat real food, stuff like that. Yeah, so, yeah. We broke up because I was gay. Yeah. That, that's basically it. It all mostly revolved around, I think her just not understanding like I just came out and told her that I have feelings towards guys and I was hoping to her to just be like, oh, okay, well we can work through that together, but unfortunately didn't take it very well. So yeah, that's kind of it. And she, I think she just, I guess she couldn't really handle the thought. And now I, I just came out like, I don't know, six months ago and it's been lit ever since, so. My hopes now, I want to be in the military, but people have brought to my attention it may not be the best thing to do with the son. I've gone through the schooling for a year now, and then I had some issues, I had to go to the hospital. So I've been, I put on medical leave for about four months now, but in reality, I just want to go out and get a job, you know, and I'll work my way up there, up the chain. I'd like to be around for Joel for when he goes to school, but finding a job and staying around my son would probably be the best bet for both of us to see him grow up and, you know, all of his questions. I can answer them, I'll always be there. I won't be out in, you know, Afghanistan helping those boys. I'll be helping my boy. And that's what's important, right? Cool. That's my, that's my hopes.